Hi guys, it's uh, Panama here again. I'm back with another late night video to talk this time about the upcoming um, Gargoyles continuation comics. Now, if you're into uh, nerdy stuff from the 90s, or you're a child of the 90s like me, you and you're around my age in your early 30s, you may remember Gargoyles. Uh, it was a, it's it's quite got quite a good cult reputation by now. It was a Disney's answer to the Batman animated TV series. It's like this darker, edgier cartoon about gargoyles turning up in New York, having been moved from a castle in Scotland, and they they defend New York from. Robot gargoyles and crazy Saturday morning cartoon stuff. The typical Saturday morning cartoon. Now, I'm not going to sit here and pretend to be um, the world's biggest gargoyles fan. I um, I watched it, obviously, as part of the 90s Disney's cartoon block here in the UK. I think it was on CBBC. And I remembered it. I remember, I think I had a gargoyles colouring book at some stage. Or something. I had some bit of, I had some bit of merchandise tat. For it, you know, as a part of my toy collection as a child, that's about it. I can remember bits from one episode. But then when I got Disney Plus in lockdown, I um it was in the nineties throwback section. I thought to myself, oh okay, I'll I'll give it I'll watch the first two episodes and see what I remember. Which I did do. And I I I can't say that I you know get much out of uh, Saturday morning cartoons these days, but for what it was, I enjoyed. I enjoyed the nostalgia of seeing it again and actually understanding what I was watching this time. Um, so moving on from there, the actual point of this video is to talk about the upcoming Gargoyles comics, which now being slightly more familiar with the cartoon, I think is kind of an interesting prospects. Now, obviously. Continuations of things in comics, whether it's Buffy or Smallville or anything really, have this kind of really dodgy reputation because sometimes when you translate something that was in motion to a still medium like comics, I don't really think it translates very well. So we'll have to wait and see with Gargoyles. A, whether I'm going to read it, because there's no guarantee that I will, because like I said, I can't pretend to be a massive Gargoyles fan. But B, we'll have to wait and see if it can even translate, because I think that's the biggest problem with translating com things into comics, as opposed to translating things from comics, is that taking motion from things often limits what they are and what they can be. Anyway, so those are my thoughts on the upcoming Gargoyles comic. It's an intriguing idea based on the an intriguing Disney property, but I'm not sure it'll work. Okay, see you guys in another video. Bye.